Okay, the number one mistake I see in the gym today is people don't exert themselves. Okay, think about that. Going through the motions, you're doing some reps. This is what I see. La 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 la. La 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 la. La 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 la. On their phone, literally, like, I've seen this before. La 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 la. Okay, guys, Arnold said it. Past the burn is where the results are or some quote like that, I'm paraphrasing. In fact, if you know the quote, please comment below because I've been using a lot of my videos and I need to get the exact quote down, so thanks for that. Arnold meant, what he meant was, when you get to those reps that are, you know, ah, like grunting, crying, screeching, burning, pain almost, like obviously not pain, joint pain, like because you're doing it not the right way, but pain in the muscle, that's where the results are from. Your results in the gym do not come from going through the motions, okay? It just doesn't happen. And I see this a lot with females, okay? Guys do it too, sure. Uh, especially you see like new people in the gym, they've never really worked out before. They don't really know what it's like to really grunt out and work through a hard set. But there's, a, but women, I see it even more because I think I think that in, in, in the female consciousness, the, the idea that you'll get big if you lift hard or heavy, right? That's still a thing. I'm surprised it's a thing, especially with Instagram, and you see all the models, all the fitness models that have the nice physiques, they all lift heavy and they go hard, right? You'll see them really struggling through reps in some of their videos, okay? You can't just be going through the motions. This is not doing anything. This is like walking, right? You're just moving your arm. Even if there's a little bit of weight attached, unless you're getting to a point where you're depleting your, your glycogen and you're depleting your ability to push something up, that's when you start getting those microtiber, microfiber tears right? And then you get what's called super compensation later on. So super compensation is what happens when your body responds to stress, it breaks down, and then it tries to build it back so that next time it's even stronger, right? That's the basic thesis for how the human being gets stronger, fitter, faster, etc. Okay? So you need to get super compensation. And the only way you do that is when you get to these point where you have these failure reps that are a struggle to get through. Okay? So going through this motion, guys, it's not enough. Three sets of ten, Let's say, for example, on the last set, maybe this is the last five reps, this is the last few reps, you should be grunting. Your eyes should be closed. You should be pushing. That's how you're going to get a result. You're not going to get a result by just going through the motions, whatever, adding five pounds each set. That's not how you're going to do it. Okay? So keep that in mind. If you're, not, if you're not physically struggling through reps every single time you do an exercise, for the most part, there are some exceptions, then you're not going to get past the burners or an old set and you're not going to get the results. You're not going to get super compensation and you're not going to grow for later. And this is true for men, women, young, old, everybody. Okay. So I hope that was useful. Comment below. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you see this often. Let me know if, if you've been struggling with that yourself. And as always, I'm at Colin Stuckert on Instagram and shoot me an email if you need anything at info at wildfoods.co. Peace.